This is your Royal Fidelity Business News. I'm the Don Davis. Service industry workers will soon see an increase in their national insurance contributions, according to NIB Minister Shane Gibson. The raise in fees paid by servers, croupiers, and other service industry workers whose weekly income is made up from tips and gratuities will be based on the amount of money they actually take home. Currently, those fees are calculated on their base pay, and this causes a problem for these workers when they apply to NIB for benefits. With the new fee structure, workers will pay more but will also receive more in benefits. The new system should come into effect as early as July. 236 companies affected by the new Providence Road Improvement Project have been given certificates of relief. This coming from the Minister of Finance, Prime Minister Perry Christie, in his budget wrap-up last evening. The certificate will allow relief for businesses affected in a number of ways. More than half the businesses have accepted micro or government guarantee loans from the Bahamas Development Bank. Others will see breaks on their real property tax, customs duties, electricity bills, and business licensing fees. 230 of the 236 companies will also be catching a break on their bills to the Broadcasting Corporation of the Bahamas. The NCAA's March Madness starts this weekend once again. Employers in the U.S. are bracing for the annual dip in productivity. Last year, businesses in the United States where college basketball's national championship tournament is an annual celebration of workplace distraction. The estimate in lost wages was over $134 million for just the first two days. Workers calling in sick is the number one issue. However, some laundry companies are being proactive and are looking for ways to minimize the losses by sponsoring bracket pools and providing 15-minute scoring updates that are distributed via email to employees. Others are allowing employees to have an extra computer screen on their desktops in order to watch the games online while they work. It's a case of if you can beat them, join them. And that's your Royal Fidelity Business News. I'm the Don Davis.